Right guys, welcome back to my channel and today we're quickly going to have a run through the team lineup for Scotland that has been selected to play Fiji on the weekend. So without further ado, let's go and have a look at the Scotland team. So starting at uh, fullback, we've got Stuart Hock, who's back into the side after missing out on the Australian game last week. Then on the wingers, we've got Darcy Graham and Duan van der Marwe again. Uh, playing on the wings who didn't have a bad game Duan van der Marwe Darcy Graham had a few opportunities last week then the uh, midfield combination of Chris Harris and Cameron Redpath will be a quite interesting one um, with Cameron Redpath uh, one of their key players a couple of seasons ago before he got injured so looking forward to see what he can do to the side then Adam Hastings and Ali Price is the halfback combination with Blair Kinghorn now uh, demoted to the uh, bench for this one after missing that vital kick we actually had a really good game but let's see what Adam Hastings can do Ali Price quality scrum off all around then if we go and have a look at the forwards Pia Skuman, George Turner and Xander Fagerson in the uh, front row combination we've heard that uh, Dave Sherry is out injured so he won't take any part in this game um, it will be interesting to see how this uh, front row combination will fare against a formidable uh, Fijian side. Then uh, the lock combination of Richie Gray and Grant Gilchrist. Obviously Sam Skinner also out injured now. So a start for Richie Gray then in the number four jersey. And then uh, the loose trio of Jamie Richie, Hamis Watson and Matt Ferguson, the same loose trio that played against Australia last week. Then if we look at the replacements quickly, Ewan Ashman, Rob Rory Sutherland, uh, Murphy Walker, Johnny Gray, Jack Dempsey, Ben White, Blair Kinghorn and Sam Axioni, uh, Dewey Pilato. So a couple of changes to this lineup, probably trying a couple of the fringe players. But Scotland needs to be very careful because this is a game that uh, if they do slip up, will reflect really badly on the world rankings. But let me know in the comment section what you guys think of the Scotland side. Um, until next time guys, this is the Rugby Guru. Cheers for now.